hello are you so this is a short um training on how to populate reports on a word document or any document for that matter using data gotten from excel so i have this report right here but i want to make this report for a, uh three different students so the name of the first student will go here the name will be here the location of the student the age of the student and then the group of that child or, or that student is going to be there but i'm going to get the details from this excel sheet right here so i have the name the age the group and the location now i'm not doing it for just one student if it was just one student i could just type it in but let's assume we have more than just three entries let's assume we have a thousand entries it would be a lot of work having to type in each individual details one by one and generating a report for each student so there is a faster way to do that automatically so how do you do that go to your word document click on the mailings at the top here you will be in the home before but click on the mailings and then you select this one that says select recipients when you click on the select recipients you see some pop-up and you select the one that says use an existing list when you click on the use an existing list it will take you to your uh, file manager so just go to the location where you saved your excel sheet so i saved mine in documents and have it here called book one i will select the excel sheet and then open it now once that is done it's going to tell ask you for the sheet where you want to work with now you know that your excel document might have more than one sheet right now i have only one sheet you can have multiple sheets so um i'm just going to work with the sheet that i have and i click ok now it is activated now what i need to do now is just change this one this detail to the name or the label pair of that student so what is the name to get that i'm going to go to this place that is now showing up that says insert merge field when i click on it you can see these options i have here serial number name age group and location is the same thing i have on the excel sheet serial number name age group and location so what i just need to do now is to go to the merge field select the name because it's the name that is coming here select the name now for the other ones too this one right here is also name it's also the name so i will go to the insert merge field name from location is the next one so for the location insert merge field location the age goes here insert merge field age and the last one is the group okay i think i have a group here so group and one more thing i think i have this name as well so name here as well okay so that is it now once that is done to check whether your detail is correct or not you can just click on this preview results when i click on preview results you can see it now you can see the first person is populated something adewale you can see the report for the name you got it from the location at the age of the age entered and group of this person is right there so you can see that's exactly what we have in this place so if i want to do for the remaining uh uh students i don't have to just i don't have to print save and print save and print because i can just click on this next right here for the next student next student like that like that and i can keep on going but as how do i now generate for each of them it's very simple just click on this finish and merge now if you want to preview the report for each student you click on this first one that says edit individual document so when you click on it and then you select from what number or what page to what page so right now i'm working with just three of them so i'll say from one to three unless you want to print for everybody but if it's just just three people and or ten people just select from one to ten like that so when i press ok it will create a new document so it has created a new document for me now if you look at this you can see this is the first student the second student and the third student now i'm having a report for each of them generated and i can then print this out or save it as i would want to so that is basically how to create or generate reports for multiple people uh, from an excel sheet thank you very much have a blessed day